viewers and subscribers welcome back to the coach's desk people so a new jamaican star seems to be looming yes somewhere along the line many persons don't know about about this athlete but we're just gonna introduce him to you at this moment his name is travis williams yes he's a sprinter from jamaica and many persons did not know about him until the Millrose game where he plays second behind American world record holder Christian Coleman. In that 60 meter, he ran 6.59 seconds. You know what I mean? He's 19 years old. He attended the University of Albany. He's a sophomore athlete. And he seems to want to ensure that he qualifies for this year's world championship. He's putting in a lot of work. And he's doing well. The Saint Anne native, yes, he's a Saint Anne native. He used to attend the York Castle High School, and he actually competed at the Issa Boys and Girls Championship. Didn't do um, excellently well. He competed in 2017-2018. He said he ran like 11 one seconds. You know, by our standard, that is not something spectacular. He later went to the United States, migrated in 2018, enrolled in Cardinal Ailes High School in the Bronx, and he has do, been doing exceptionally well. He copped a lot of awards in 4x200 meters. In, 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 in 2021, he won the Catholic High School Athletics Association MVP. He, that later allowed him to sign to the University of Albany in, in 2021. But he was hampered by injuries and he did not really showcase his talent um, in 2021. The last season, there was a lot of ups and downs for him. He was hurt. He broke, uh, he broke the 7 seconds in the 60 meter one time. Then he ran like 698. That was nothing spectacular according to him. Now, assistant sprint coach Junior Burnett recognized the potential in the young sprinter. A matter of fact, Junior um, Burnett is also a Jamaican coach, former GC at uh, Foster coach or student there. So yeah, he's doing pretty well with that uh, youngster. So he has done exceptionally well with the athlete. He, 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 he has come down to 6.59. Uh, that gives him the fastest time over 60 meters for any athlete in Jamaica. Um, so there, there and then. He is really, 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 really putting in the work and he looks forward to make this national team that we will be sending to the World Athletics Championship later on this year. So on the heels of that, people, after doing so well at the Millrose game and people start to put their eyes on him, Travis Williams win the 60 meter and the 200 meter double in a championship record times at the american east indoor track and field championship you know what i mean so the he, he basically was letting persons know that the 6.59 seconds at the millrose game uh, on february 11 was no fluke and the 19 year old intend on doing well he, he clocked a championship and conference record of 6.64 to finish uh streets streets ahead of uh shavar states of the University of Maryland, Baltimore. You know what I mean? So he, he definitely showed up in that event. Um, he was just getting warmed up as he later took gold in the 200 meter in 20.89 seconds. Also a championship and conference record. So this young man is doing pretty well. He is getting his name out there. Not many persons knew about him, but I want you to pay attention to Travis Williams this year, people. He seemed to be going to do some damage. Many athletes talk about, or fans talk about the 60 meter, still 40 meters to go. Uh, that is just indoor. But if this is by any indication or any means, then certainly Travis will be doing well based on what he has been doing in the indoor this season. So that's an introduction to Travis Williams, people. I want you to share your comments down below in the comment section about this athlete. What are your thoughts? Until next time, stay safe.